Okay, I came all the way out to IOI today. We're starting on the, the back, I think this is the back nine? Back nine, no, front nine. Who knows? Okay, Marcia, let's have some fun. Today's focus is going to be putting. I'm looking at taking more time on my putts. Let's hope that it works. Strike. What a drive, man! Keep rolling, 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 rolling. My new habit on the golf course is uh, to check where my feet are aiming. Because recently, my ball has been going all over the place. Got lucky, it's in the bunker. You know how much I love bunkers. <laughs> Got my seven iron people. Okay, I'm checking where my feet are aiming. It's a bit fat and it bounced on the cart path. Nobody loves the cart path better than I do. And Sandy are going in the bunker. We love a bit of a beach adventure. This is what happens. I talk myself through my bunker shot. I dig my feet in. I sit down a little bit. I open the club face and I swing just behind the ball. Okay. I'm going to stick to the theme of being better around the greens. Right. Okay, let's see if I can putt. Let's see. Shot out the bunker. The slope here. Let's be smart around the green. Okay, I've lined up my next putt pretty well. Not too bad. I'm going to go and check the burn mark to see which way the grass is, is growing and then I'm going to walk the line so that I can see the feel of the green. Bird mark is at the back. So I'm going to try and put it a bit straight into the hole because the burn mark's at the back and to be honest it looks like a Pretty straight putt, but we'll we'll see how that goes. Now, this, around this part of the green, I'm always like, should I take my sandy or should I take my putter? 
I'm gonna take a risk, be a bit smarter, and control the distance with my putter. And it was a much smarter shot. So I've got a good putt. I'm walking the hole. Burn mark is at the back of the cup, so that means I should probably hit it straight. Oh, I completely missed it this time. Yeah. Okay. more aggressive with my putts I think I'm sort of being a little bit cute Woo! I usually use my seven fairway wood out of deep rough now. The club tends to get less caught up in the grass. My irons used to get caught in the grass. No more Mr. Nice Guy. I just hit the back of the green on the hill. Hey man, you stop me from shanking. Okay. This is tough. That was a smart shot. I used the hill. Guns out. Which way the green? Okay, I didn't film my uh, hit with the uh, the shot with the uh, eight iron, so I had to lay it up here because there's a nice big donga down there where my ball has the potential to go into. So I'm gonna take it's about 207 yards. I'm gonna take a three wood from here. I haven't read the rule book that says you shouldn't use your putter from the rough, so I used my putter from the rough. It gives me a little bit more control over the distance of the ball and also the power. Unfortunately, you can't see where the ball is on this shot because my camera tripod was perched up against a tree. So you could imagine what kind of shot I was hitting here. You know what? I'm going to use my putter 
to control the distance. Why did it have to hit this hill? It hit this one. That's okay. <laughs> it's all behind burn marshes over here. Put your foot down. A little too cutsky. On me. Okay. No. I thought I might take a trip to the lake to see what it was like. My ball, my ball is sitting over here. It's over here, my ball, next to the beautiful lake. This was a very lucky shot. I wish I could say it was skill, but it was definitely, definitely luck. I have, a, I have a lovely tip for all my Ed Gaff golfers out there. Uh, maybe you should, you should always check your clubs before you play with them. Check if they've got a P or an S or a 9, something. Check that they've got those numbers on them. Because uh, I just played a P on my last shot and I thought it was my Sandy. Oops! Fatty, fatty, boom, boom, fatty. Oh. Oh, it's safe in the jungle, but I can get it out the jungle.
thanks for watching see you on the next episode uh, like subscribe and click the bell thing <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.